In this video I'm going to show you how to do a stake out. There's two ways of getting to the stake out. You can either select your side shot and then the staking menu or you can use your plumb bulb icon and then go to staking. On this instrument you can stake various things. You can stake points, stake lines, elevations, stake alignment, the surface or you can do a staking list. For the purpose of this video I'm just going to stake a point. You can select stake point and then select the point that you want to stake. In this case, the point that I want to the point that I want to stake is P003. Select the point that you want to stake. And select the stake point. So this is the calculator what your instrument should read when you're on the point. So you click on OK. The first thing we do is we rotate the horizontal to zero. So I'm going to rotate the horizontal to zero. happy with with one second and we select the staking icon. The instrument will then take the measurement and tell you how far you should be, should be moving on your northern easting elevation as well as your cut and fall. From there you would select store point. It's telling you what you've done. Our cut is zero millimeters, our designed elevation and our measured elevation as well as our delta easting and northing. I'm happy with that. You've got the option to save either your point and the raw data or you save your raw data only. I prefer saving the point and the raw data. Select the point and the raw data. They give your point a name. In this case, I'm just going to call it SDK1 or stake 1. And you store your point. From there, you can go to the next point, which will be P004, or you've got the option to stake the nearest point to where you are now.